in order to be guided but that animal has no power to move freely at times they are in twos they will use one wood to hold two of them so that they cannot run away but to that animal is looking at that one as a bondage i want to be free now i want to be free i want to be free didn't you want to be free answer me didn't you want to be free every month in a social complaint the trouble where you carry last year is still there around last two months is there your body three months ago there body four months ago every month you write prayer requests every month prayer requests whoever comes to this altar to preach you meet them pastor pray for me today the final solution has come a man told me pastor i believe the bible i asked him what do you mean he said i was I, I, he was an hunter he was going for hunting in the night then he saw a monster a monster a beast that by name mommy water seated on the wooden bridge and that was the path this brother was to pass through hey look at me you not know who you be if you know you won't complain again do you know whom you are? That, you say, they don't answer me. Do you know who you are? Ask that person, you know who you be at all. You don't know. Ask him, you know who you be. You say, Pastor, as I was to pass through that line, I saw this monster gazing at me from a far distance. I want my king telling me go back that person you are seeing is a monster there is no way ladies and gentlemen that darkness and light jam and darkness will conquer it has not been it cannot be when cats only one pussy cat said the territory of of rats where rats are holding conference and in that conference you have one million rats as soon as they hear yeah. 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 in my place in those days we don't see pussycat for eye because when pussycat in my place say, yeah. the meaning in my place is where are where are where are <laughs> come on do like this hey, the man looked he looked at the beast, the monster, and the monster was waiting. The rats, I am going to magnet or walk on this man. He will start fidgeting, and before you know, he will go back. But the man remember the scriptural verse: "Blessed is he that cometh in the name of the Lord." And he stretched forth his hand. You beast, Awaboa, we need not see Jesus. The beast did not wait for Jesus' name to be spared. As soon as he heard, when in, in the name of Oriel, God told the Israelites, the yoke shall be broken. How many of you want God to break the yoke from your neck? I don't know the type of yoke you may be passing through. It could be sickness, it could be sin, it could be manipulation, it could be attack. As we were praying yesterday, a man picked my microphone. He said, Oh God, why you were ministering and you were praying? Fish, fish. My peer, you were there. Fish, vanish, came out from my body. Fish. Stand to your feet. I want to pray. I want to pray this yoke shall be broken this yoke shall what shall what shall what shall what yoke shall what I have not shared this testimony here because we are from various units but my members that way they know I was preaching the television a small girl of 18 years old. I don't know her. All the way from far away, 
the boundary between a door and data she watched the program on the screen then as soon as i said let's pray touch your television she touched her television and fell inside her room then she said wow i never jammed this kind of power before who be this man of god she copied the phone number on the screen and phone man of god can i see you sir i said no you can't see me because if all, all people watching my our program our telecast want to see me there'll be no chance for me to do that things but go and see my spokesman she's beg and pleaded oh god i beg you as i look at her plea i said okay you come now so she be for grand 18 years from grand from this grand no no from there I said, be 18 years when she came she entered my office the first thing she asked who are you who are you who are you uh -uh. now you phone you want to have an audience with me and you enter my office the first salutation that come out from your mouth is to question my authority no no she started vibrating in my office then i said jesus answer her jesus will answer them are you hearing me people who are who, who question your authority jesus will answer them people who's asking you the type of god you are serving god will answer them when i said jesus answer her she fell let me tell you the disturbing story that came out from my mouth he said oh god look me as small as i be i i don't kill 28 people how many my pastors i invited some of them to come the next day and come out here reverend binoba was there reverend isaiah was there uh reverend Udo, about six of them i said come out here Sumba was there. Come out here in the day of his power, his people shall be ready. It's a guy of key 28. I shuttle between Ore and Portacot. The last one I did was one small boy. The boy saw me walking along the road twisting my waist and the boy was carried away by the kebe that he saw and the boy looked at the kebe please if you don't look look where assemblies of god youth let me tell you don't go outside assemblies go to find get away one marry the wish where you know he better pass what the angel where you know no People who come, I don't know, if they happen from a presbytery, people where they marry on a guest, from, now from, many of them are from other churches. When you ask them, you not see guests from a church, you go say they did, but assemblies of God will not excellence. Because in our church, if you do bad, we discipline you, we don't care. Assemblies of God does not know who is called a district superintendent. Assemblies of God doesn't know who is called general superintendent. If the general go astray, which we know, he cannot. He cannot but if he does go if you try go astray the constitution the generality of the public assemblies will hold him and they will pass a vote of no confidence if i go astray the presbyters will hold a meeting and pass a vote of no confidence i am not the founder i am not the president jesus is the owner of the church and that is why boys listen you see, you see, get, our boys want to find guests. They don't look for assemblies. They go find for kerosene and, sel and selfie. Others will go to Jehovah wickedness. The other one will go to o Olu, 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 Olu. Now you talk also. No! What has light with darkness? Say, Pastor, I, I will not serve the same God. No, 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 no. We are not serving the same God. Why me go go marry a Muslim or a Mohammedan? When I am praying in the name of Jesus, she is saying, Bismillah, Ramam Rahim. Alhamdulillah, Ramam Rahim. Allah. Allah. 
Are you guys? Let me talk to you. Please take this. If you know how to wait on the Lord, wait. If you don't know how to wait, tell God to give you the spirit of patience and tolerance. Than to be to be haste. You want to marry on time. Before you know, you carry arm robber. You carry Boko Haram as husband. You carry Boko Haram, come church. Say, God, don't give me husband. You are digging your grave. Especially those who say, I want test and face. I want test and face. They don't spoil church. They don't spoil church. See your daughter. I married her from here. Ask her. She was staying after Guinness. Opposite that, the other side here. The day I visited her, rain went to fall. Ask her. I tell her, say, sister, sorry. I'm going. We'll see another day. But the young modern day boys will say, rain. Now God, I create rain. As rain the fossil, sister, I go sleep here today. Blessed are thou among women. Listen, every child of God, before I pray. Because there's nothing that God cannot do. God can change your wilderness, God can change your story. God can wipe away your reproach. This joke shall what? This joke shall what? If God, if God, if God be for us, who? If you want God to remove yoke from your life, come here. There are some yokes, some barriers in your life you have been experiencing. You don't like them again. Come. Come. You want God to remove reproach, yoke from your life. Some of you, look me. When I'm talking to assemblies of God people, I don't spare. Whether you be pastor, I don't care. The highest they can do is to gather together and vote me out. Some of you, you the worker after church service, that place where they go. What are you going to find for them? If a man's way pleases the Lord, what happened? You see, even if I pray and you not change your way of life, quarrel, if you don't look for people in the quarrel, where, where, come assemblies. If you don't look for people, assemblies of God is a nice church, doctrinally very nice. In terms of holiness, or use the word holistically, fine. I think we are better than many, 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 many others. But we must still tell ourselves the truth in some areas that we err. If you come to women's meeting, if this is not day there, peace, good day. But as soon as she come, Madam Wahala don't come. You come to youth meeting, the same thing. Men's meeting, how can only one person be shaking the whole church? If I come out for the church, he goes fall. Oh, that's monkey banana. Minus you. God can do something. Now we be foundation. Now we be foundation. Which foundation? We will not get this. When they were praising Jesus as he was entering to Jericho, the Pharisee came and met his disciples and said, Warn your people. Uh, met Jesus and said, Warn your disciples. The way they are praising you is too much. Tell them to keep quiet. He said, You mean it? They should keep quiet. Let them keep quiet. God will raise up stones. I am the type of preacher, if I call you, come out and I tell you what you're supposed to do. If you do one, the miracle will not happen. Phone me. Call my line. Lift up your hands and say, Oh God! Oh God! 
Oh God, I have suffered enough. I have suffered enough. I have suffered enough. I have suffered enough. Remove this body from my neck. Remove this body from my neck. Remove this yoke from my shoulder. Remove this yoke from my shoulder. Break the yoke by the anointing. Break the yoke by the anointing. Oh, I open your mouth. Oh, I open. You lift your voices. Break the yoke. 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 Every yoke on my shoulder. Nowhere. Nowhere. Power of God in my life. The power of God in my life. He has broken the iron gate and give me victory. The power of God in my life. Look at me. Finally, look at you. This is the final prayer point. But look my face. The Lord makes me to know. You see, the problem in our church is disobedience. Disobedience. When you claim to know, whereas you don't know anything. I've been in the church for 40 years, 40 something years, and so on. But tell me, what have you, your life has been able to impact on the church? Look at the church. You understand? You tear this skin now, or flesh now. The blood that will come out is AG assemblies I didn't come from the moon I know what our people practice I know what we do pastors and members but if we can remove this garment of Saul David was to go and confront Goliath Saul told him you can't go you are a small boy okay if you must go wear this my work garment David wore it, wore it on himself as he counted the first step second one he couldn't proceed he said oh god i have never tried this one before i think i better i better, I better remove it i better remove it and as soon as he remove it as soon as he remove it people were telling him why not wear? he said no for people some persons trust in shadows others trust in horses but for me my house we will remember the name of the lord our god for the hands of flesh shall fill you it's okay good luck good luck and it went you see that garment it pull away is the power of flesh evil practices seducing spirits uncleanliness uncleanly gathering joining people to commit sin i am not surprised if we have a courtist here looking at me today i would be surprised if i have somebody here looking at me who are from 12 o'clock midnight we go to a meeting and turn to god and turn to foul i won't be surprised because even in the book of job satan presented himself in the gathering of god's people But listen, if you change, the Bible says in Isaiah, if you are willing, and if you are willing, and what? Obedient. Go, you are a student of the Bible. Go and do this research. Find out people who were not willing and were not obedient. And at last, God visited them and blessed them. Go and search and tell me. Is God, is jealous. Is his glory is jealous his righteousness he said my glory i will not share with any man no my praises with graven images the young girl met me so god no verse no drive me away from what you want here now no drive me i won't join this my evangelism table no no drive me this thing i want to tell you happened two years ago i've been notorious prostitute prostitute i do prostitution tire for libya i come nigeria i continue just two years ago somebody preached to me and i enter assemblies of god i told her what you did before was before now that you are in christ you are a new nature a new creature all those things i can't drive you I want to pray this prayer you know why it will be wrong after this particular forum the same complaint the same con the same thing still continue you like her 
if my people say if you kiss snake you never remove the head you don't kill him look me you do here go set to the problem your problem is embedded into inside settlement you say no forgive that person go forgive him you know you no forgive him the problem will remain like that now babu you tell you they look at me now they keep malice inside church but now they call only ghost fire when i talk this message for uba one day i was pastoring them then i say open confession not close your eyes if you don't offend anybody inside church go meet them go beggar this one will go me this one did they cry sister i'm sorry did they cry dear i see another one somebody doesn't say sorry no for no no verse say let me let me uh, why some they cry the other one come now nah, now nah, you know now nah, now nah, you know let me in my mother Jesus Christ, O Jonas. Abba. Is there no more bam in Gilead? Uh, there is bam in Gilead. A sister, they suspend her for one church. You don't come to our church. He said, oh God, I want to attend my church. Now they like your blessing. Wait, wait. As she was talking, I heard the Holy Spirit saying, she's under suspension. I said, sister, they suspend you for your church. He said, sir, who must have told you? You may hide it from man. You can't hide it from God. Go back and serve your suspension. Okay, let's not looking for members that are, that are suspended. Stretch out your hand to the altar. As you stretch out your hand, before me, release my own prayer. Now, open your say, release, open your mouth and say, God, God, any area I have sinned against you, any area I've sinned against you, consciously and unconsciously, consciously and unconsciously, forgive me, forgive me, Lord. All forms of evil practices. All forms of evil practices in my life. In my life. Physically and spiritually. Physically and spiritually. All art of disobedience. All kinds of disobedience. Forgive me. Forgive me. Now begin to pray. Begin to pray. In the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, Lord. I ask for forgiveness for mercy. In every area I sin against you in thought, in words, in action, in what I've done and in what I've failed to do that does not bring glory and honor to your holy name. I ask oh, Father that you forgive me. In Jesus' name. Amen. Now place that hands on your head. Enough is enough. As we echo, Amen. You look. I take authority from the throne of grace and I command you yoke be broken in Jesus name Amen. the journey that would have taken you two days Abba. is taking you 20 years today as we echo Amen, this yoke this barrier, Abba. this manipulation, Abba. this oppression, Abba. this suppression, Abba. this attack, Abba. every Abba. Abba. every stagnancy, Abba. every and evil and writing on the wall, Abba. be countered by fire, be destroyed by fire, be destroyed by fire, Amen. be destroyed by fire, Amen. be destroyed by fire, Amen. in the name of Jesus, shut up. As you place your hand on your head, they don't laugh you, Taya. They nickname you, they don't laugh you, laugh you where well, where. Well. In your papa house, you don't get name, you don't get glory again. When they see you, they're gonna laugh you. You day here, you be man, you be woman, you be boy, you be girl. I feel not know you, but God knows you. But you are standing here today, wherever you are under this edifice. You don't cry too much. You don't cry tired. 
you are denied your right to your profession. Instead, make you they prosper your your business. You they go back every day. You they go back every year. You that people are depending upon. You are the one depending on people. What a shame! What a reproach! You have written exam countless times. Even the one you wrote last time, you came out with flying color, but yet nothing good seems to come out from your life. Who must have bet with you? You cannot go far than you than where you are now. Who must have told you that? Answer me. See that man. See that woman. See that boy. See that girl. Answer is coming now. Answer has come. See that woman. See that man. See that boy. See that girl. He don't tell whether they laugh me. They don't laugh me. Pastor, they don't laugh me. Because of the kind children when I get. Because of the kind wife. Because of the kind husband. I don't know what I go do again. Pastor, I don't tire. I don't tire. It don't become every note for my neck. I know the few work I get. I don't know what I go do again. Now so Christianity be. Answer me. They have mimicked these people. They have mocked them too much. They have laughed at them too much. They don't laugh at them too much. Spirit of the living God. I stretch my hand. Where is that man? Where is that woman? Where is that boy? Where is that girl? Where is that boy? Where is that girl? Where is that man? Where is that woman? Look for that person. Oh, you have to see that person. Oh, you have touched that person. Oh, you have answered that person. Power! You both parade the good one and the bad pastors. I don't blame you. It's not your fault. You, because you were looking for a solution. The fountain of life is flowing everywhere. Whosoever dreams shall never ever trust again. The fountain of life is moving everywhere. Whosoever dreams shall never ever trust again. Baba, as they answer Amen now, enough to this reproach, enough to this yoke, enough to this bondage. Whatever name your yoke or reproach is called, as we say Amen now, I put them down. Whatever predicament you are in now that has relegated you, you that are supposed to be celebrated by now, you are just like the city that was forgotten. You the pride of all people. You that ought to have been the light bearer. But you have not become the object of scorn and reproach. As you place your hand on your head and echo amen. Today, I nail this reproach to the cross of Calvary. And as you answer another amen, anywhere they padlock your joy, your glory, your testimony, your victory, your celebration, I break the padlock. I break it. 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 from today good news will not finish from your life I had administration saying tell them good news good news 
good news. It is your own affair today. It shall be according to my word. It shall be according to my word. In the name of him that raised Jesus from the grave. In the name of Jesus.